Hello everyone, very good morning and good evening. Parminder here. Welcome to SAP S4 HANA Excellence Trainings. Now today we are going to jump into Fury. Okay, so Fury is a new interface which we'll be having available. But let's first discuss quickly on what kind of different interfaces we have. In ECC, ECC what kind of different interfaces we have? In ECC, we were having a GUI, NWBC and Fury. So that's a big question comes if uh, Fiori was available in ECC or Fiori is available in S4 HANA. So if you are using ECC, the previous version, in ECC also we are having a three different kind of interfaces is available. GUI, which we use the blue screens, the SAP logon pad, that is a GUI. Then we have a NWBC client, NetWeaver business client. With NetWeaver business client, we were able to log in into the all of the applications, all of the transaction through the browser okay through the google chrome browser you would be able to log into the different different application okay so in nwbc so what what happened with the nwbc so before jumping into the fury sap actually went to the nwbc where they have tried that each transaction would be converted into the html version so when you use on a browser a transaction uh, uh, through NWBC, its look and feel is exactly same. It's exactly blue screen rather than opening in your uh, SAP GUI graphical user interface. It get opens into the browser, but the look and feel would be exactly same. That's the point before moving to Fury, SAP started moving ahead. But apart from the look and feel, what they have worked on, they have also worked on some kind of a mini dashboards would be there, where rather than going and punching the transaction is still possible, but on the tab, different different roles would be available and based on the different different roles you would be seeing you would be able to go through the applications okay that is basically available through nwbc okay and it is role based based on the role assigned to you there has a specific roles created for nwbc also and based on the roles assigned to you the screen will appear okay it's not that interactive or attractive screen which we have in fury but role based approach is also available in NWBC. GUI, NWBC, these both are also available in S4 HANA also. Okay, so the role-based approach would be there. So what kind of roles you can uh, go through it? So let me quickly show you in system. So you can see that uh, roles which I have mentioned here, SAP EPLO, okay, SAP EPLO, MMME001. These are the roles which is available, which can be used for the NWBC application. So this will be giving you access to the uh, purchasing documents. Okay. So how to, if you want to check the NWBC, it's very simple. We'll go into the transaction slash N, NWBC. It will try to open in this uh, internet browser. So what I would be doing, I will try to open it in. So here I'm having a, these different roles, I'm having it. Right, so that's what system is showing. I can go to the state of NWBC cockpit. So here I don't have a much of the roles. So the screen which appears in front of me, it's like that. Only the authorization defaults, which is uh, coming here. SAP Fury uh, Launchpad Application Manager is coming. So we need to get the roles assigned. Okay, so the roles which I have shown you, if you get those roles assigned to you, like this SAP uh, EPLOMM kind of roles, for each of the modules, it's available. I'll just assign one role to me so that I can show you how does it look like. You will not be having this access. Just to show you that in ECC and in S4 HANA both, NWBC is available. Let me search the roles. So these are the roles available. Let me assign this one to me, purchasing document role. save it i will now go back to the so you can see now sap ep lomm 01 is coming so this role i am having so once i will go to this role you see here i i see a lot of things here on the thing on the top i have purchase requisition purchase order outline agreement rfq analytics left hand side i have a transaction me 51 52 for the purchase requisition purchase requisition release transactions so rather than having a blue screen, now this is a little bit structured dashboard, we can say it, which is available, where you would be having 
on the top you would be having a, a different kind of uh, access you have different kind of document access so this is your role allo purchasing documents right if you have a three roles the all the roles in nwbc it is coming will come here and this work exactly same for your ecc and s4 hana the roles would be coming here then under this role what are the things available purchase requisition available purchase order available it will come here how to, how you can go ahead and create a purchase order me21 end screen will come here and these all things are available on the browser reporting release display inbound delivery this is available outline agreement rfq quotation analytics so this is nwbc nwbc with nwbc all of the transaction you would be able to have access through your browser okay but the look and feel is same this is the same exactly same way you punch the transaction in me21n right all the different uh, these tabs are available and everything is still a cluttery screen that simplification not has been done it's the still cluttery screen you can have a option here you can jump into the different transaction code also let's try to jump to spro from here so even you would be able to jump into the spro also from here on the browser okay sap fiori would be using a lot of this uh, nwbc elements in the fiori applications right but this is the first uh, approach which sap gone for now sap understand that this is a still cluttery screen these screens cannot be used on the mobile apps or tablets or touch base system okay maybe in the browser you can use it we can eliminate the uh, gui login pad we have a benefit of the roles whatever the roles has been provided to you that things you see in front of you otherwise just uh, here uh, with sap gui login once you log in you just see here this thing so you are procurement purchase uh, production sales finance still same thing looks to you then you need not you need to go inside this to find out your transactions or generally we train people on the transaction code they directly come here punch the transaction and proceed ahead but the explorativeness is less here it become little bit more uh, explorative in nature and the fury will take it to the next levels okay so this is how the nwbc is there mm -hmm.